I snuck out of the house. I'm a rebel. Hey y'all, so it is currently 2.30 in the morning and I'm going to be sneaking out of my house for the first time because I was laying in bed. As you can see, I was ready to go to bed. I have my spa treatment on, but I'm not tired at all. And I wanna go do something. So I said, let's take the car and go find something to do. So I said, why not vlog it while I'm at it? Okay, so I've seen this in movies. People put pillows to make a fake body to make it look like I'm sleeping in my bed. <laughs> That was so easy. Oh my goodness, this is so easy. You literally just walk outside of your house. As long as my parents don't wake up. Well, the gag is we still need tape. Honestly, suggest to anyone, if you don't have a tripod, just get yourself some good old tape. I didn't really think this through with the lighting, but that's okay. I'm gonna put my hood on. One, because I look like a sewage rat. And two, because no one can recognize me. I cannot be ratted out. I'm getting like extra paranoid, okay. Ladies and gentlemen, let's get our, oh, let's lock the door. It is currently 2.47. All right, I snuck out. That was so easy. I don't know why I've never snuck out before. I'm literally 20 years old and this is my first time sneaking out, which is sad, but better late than never, all right? I'm not supporting sneaking out of the house, but I mean, you're a loser if you don't sneak out of the house. I mean, I feel like every 16 year old has done this. I just never had a reason to sneak out because <laughs> like when I was in high school and elementary school after like 12 o'clock I was like all right it's time for bed I don't need to be outside at this time so I'm an adult which means I really shouldn't be sneaking out I know if you're thinking if you're 20 years old why are you even sneaking out well first of all I'm brown so that makes a difference and second of all I live with my parents I've always lived with my parents so the rule is if you're under their house, you obey their rules. And I know for a fact my mom would not want me just leaving the house without me telling her. So it's whatever, I'm a rebel and I don't even know what to do. I'm thinking of driving to McDonald's because um, I'm a little hungry, a little midnight snack. Instead of going downstairs to the kitchen, I'm taking the car out. Oh, I'm such a loser. But this is nice, cruising. There's no cars on, there's one car on the road there, but that's about it. This is nice, I get to take my time. I get to relax. All right, oh, I still have my acne cream on. Oh, whatever, it's a look. So, oh my goodness, wait, it's 2.50. What time does breakfast start? Because I really want nuggets. Oh Lord Jesus, please don't start at three. Oh my God, I'm getting nervous now. Okay, forget, the, forget lay back and relax. We are ready to drive. We gotta make this. I even brought sunglasses to get more into disguise, but I realized that I need to see in order to drive. Well, I can, I know my town. I need to get my disguise on. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. No one will know a thing that I have snuck out! <laughs> this is so cool. I love how most people, when they sneak out, they're like going to a party or going to Toronto the 6th and I'm going to McDonald's. I, I feel rebellious though because my parents have no idea I'm here. They're at home dreaming away and I'm here. Mm -hmm. um, the thing is when I think sneaking out, I think like getting a ladder outside your window and your friends are like all down there like, come on, let's go, let's go Becky. And I'm here like, ah, I'll just walk down the stairs, open the door and get my car. 
It's the same thing, all right? I'm sneaking out. The point of sneaking out is going out without your parents knowing. And that's what I'm doing, so, you know. It's, it's hard being a rebel, it's hard. It's hard being a rule breaker, you know? A lot of people don't get it, but I don't like rules, and I don't like to obey them, so. <laughs> it's what I do, it's what I do. I'm a rule breaker, what can I say? Should I put the windows down? I should. Feel that nice breeze. I snuck out of the house. I'm a rebel. Ooh, there's no cars in the drive through Thank you. No, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Let's see if I can get a free meal. I have a question. I snuck out of the house. Pardon? I snuck out of the house to get yeah. this meal. Yeah. So can I get it for free? Uh, I don't think so. I don't see a manager. Is she asking the manager? She's walking around. Is this happening? Wait, is this is this happening? Okay, this could either end really good or really bad. Hi. Hi. Are you the manager? Huh? Are you the manager? Yes, madame. I snuck out of the house just to get this meal. The what? I snuck out of my house to get this meal, yeah. so I'm risking my life. For what? Because I can get in trouble. So could I get this meal for free? Sorry? Could Why do you have a... Um, uh, do you order by uh, Uber? No. What? Myself. I ordered over there. Okay. So, I risked my life because I snuck out of the house for the meal. So for can I get... Meal. For the meal. So could I get it for free because I risked my life? So what's the problem with that? Oh, there's no problem. Yeah. Why you have to ask for a free meal? Because I snuck out of my house Not for it. Not my problem. Oh my goodness. Okay. So that will be debit. Well, um, that did not work out at all. She didn't understand what I was saying. I can help you. Hi, what donuts do you have right now? Thank you, that's everything. <laughs> have you ever uh, snuck out of the house? No. No? <laughs> Rookie. You should try sneaking out one day. <laughs> have a good one. She's like, girl, I am 43 years old. I don't need to sneak out. Alrighty. No. Oh, God, I almost cracked my phone. Okay. Let's try and make it back alive, ladies and gentlemen. We're back in the house. Or not yet. seeing you in my next video.